Shapula. No, she did not just fart. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? LD Shy Lady here and welcome back. Oh, well I had barely got started with this episode and we've already been invited on a date by this fine gentleman. Yes, Edward Fine, we shall go to GeekCon together. Just me and you, okay? So as I was saying, welcome back to The Sims 4 Disney Princess Challenge. We are currently on Generation 2, Princess Belle. She has to date five guys before she can find her man. And it looks like Edward Fine is gonna be guy number three. So let's see how this little date goes, shall we? Ooh, this looks so cool. And it's kind of cool that he invited us to GeekCon because clearly he knows that we're kind of into books and stuff. Why, why, why is he running off? Follow that man! Where is he going? Where is he going? Okay, thank you for joining me once again, Edward. Why don't we just hang out and have some fun? Okay, so let's see what we can do here then at GeekCon. Looks like there is a lot of nerdy stuff. We got some computers randomly out in the open. Wow, she is a very interesting looking lady, isn't she? I like her. Let's go talk to her. Wow, that dress! Dang! Girl! You know what, actually, maybe we should concentrate on our date. <gasps> How are we supposed to concentrate on our date when Travis Scott, the ex, is right here? How awkward. <sighs> what is he doing at GeekCon? Okay, why don't we um, spy on apartments? Yep, because what else would you do at GeekCon? <laughs> I feel like such a creep right now. This is so wrong. This place is awful for a date. I don't think we should have come here, but we can work on this rocket together. So maybe that could be romantic. It doesn't look very romantic, does it? <gasps> What's that? Oh my gosh! What? A, a rocket just landed. Whoa! It had people inside. Wanda and Rupert Fudge. <laughs> what were they doing in that rocket? And can I do it with Edward, please? That seems to be the best way to take our relationship to the next level, quite literally. So let's have a little romance going on here. I think he's ready for it. Okay, what the heck is my brother Walt doing here? Walt, get out of here! Walt, you are really cramping my style here. I'm gonna start flirting with this guy and you better get out of here. You're not gonna wanna see the way that Belle flirts. This is super weird. Bye bye now. Okay, we're gonna have to get away from GeekCon for a second. Let's go sit on this bench over here in the quiet and we can get a flirt on. Where's Edward? Uh, Who's that? That's not Edward. Is he replacing Edward? Nope, he's walked off in the opposite direction. Oh, here comes Edward. He's probably just checking that the rocket's clear for takeoff before we hop on in. Oh my gosh, I thought he was about to sit on me. <laughs> okay, let's do a little bit of flirting now that we're in private. Uh, uh. Oh dear. Okay, maybe we're just not friendly enough. That's what it is. I'm gonna be here all night flirting with him if that's what it takes. One eternity later. This is it. I'm ready to make a move. Woohoo! Bell's so smooth. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is good. This is great. Yes, okay. Can we do a full kiss yet? Uh -huh. Let's do it. Oh, look at this cute little romantic location. Yeah, that's right. Nobody can resist Princess Belle. I think we're ready to take a ride on this rocket now. <gasps> no! What? The rocket disappeared. How did that happen? When am I going to get another chance to ride the love rocket? Oh, this lady has no legs. Why are people in this world so freaking terrifying? I didn't want to ride on the love rocket anyway after seeing that. Okay, Edward, let's exchange numbers for later. I'll hit you up when Geek Con is back in town. Bye bye now. Oh, I'm so disappointed. We had him right in our clutches and then he slipped away. Things just aren't going well for Princess Belle. Let's get her into bed so we can try again tomorrow. Now I have the perfect idea for what we should do today. We are heading back into the city. So Belle, you better put some freaking clothes on because we are going to visit the Arts Quarter. <gasps> pigeons is a good sign. So many pigeons. Oh, who's this guy? Well, hello there, sir. 
May I say, you have a beautiful walk. I would like to say hello to you. So, um, let's get to know each other a little bit. This guy's pretty friendly. Oh, he's, he's walked off. Why does this always happen? I guess this food is really good. Why is everyone here green? Except for this guy. Gaston. What a beautiful name. Hello, Gaston. Wow, this is a party now. But who is this guy? Who actually dresses like that? Are those real abs? I'm so confused. I don't know how to feel. So maybe we should go somewhere that there are less green people. So we can have some private time, Gaston. What's over here? Other than pigeons. Let's go stand by this person. Oh my gosh. Look at her inside that suit. Wow. She looks hilarious. Oh gosh, that guy's back. <gasps> I think he touched me. <gasps> that was horrible. I guess we should say hi to him. He seems like he just needs a friend, you know? Oh, great. Gaston's got away. Let's try and calm him down. What is wrong with him? Okay, this guy's a little bit crazy. This is probably why you shouldn't speak to strangers on the street all the time. Okay, this was a mistake. Let's go find Gaston. Oh, there he is. He's up here in the art gallery. I'm just gonna creep on him for a little bit, see what he is doing. He's come to do some work over here. Wait, did he just steal something? What? Did I just witness a theft? What the heck? I don't know if I can date a man that clearly steals from people. Okay, let's hang out over here because there's nothing more romantic than pigeons. And I need all the help I can get to seduce this man. It's working. Uh-oh. No. Not again! No! This can't be happening. Go after him, Belle. Don't let him get away like the others. Okay, we're just gonna have to romance him before he can get away. He's got a kind of a funky arm, but I can look past that. No! I said I could look past the funky arm! Come back. I'm just gonna go straight in for the hug. Hang on. It's this guy again! Why is he always around? It's like he's stalking me, but never talks to me. How unusual. Well, off he goes. Oh, wow. Things progress quickly while I was away for a second. Let's just keep doing more of that. Gaston doesn't seem so bad after all. Right, okay, we're going back to the pigeons. We said we're going back to the pigeons, Gaston. Where we shall have our first kiss. Nothing more romantic than a pigeon flying around. Oh, where's he going? I can't believe he's just gonna kiss me and then leave. Where the heck is he going? Where is he disappearing off to? <gasps> and what is this beauty? Wow, I'm gonna buy it. It's so cute. Wait, hang on, where did Gaston go? Huh, he's just walking off over this way. <gasps> he disappeared. How many times is this gonna happen to me? Alone again. He must live around here somewhere. I'm gonna check all these apartments until I find him. Does he live here? No, he does not live here. Okay, how about this one? Nope, he doesn't live here either. Okay, this one. <gasps> I think I found him. Let's go inside. Wow, look at this girl. Really coordinating her outfit with her skin color. She's actually so cute. I'm gonna flirt with her. I don't know why. The option was there. I couldn't help myself. Oh, she's so adorable. Look at her. Well, let's focus on the mission at hand. Let's go upstairs and see if we can find Gaston. Where is he? I'm coming for him. Oh, here we are. Looks like he's checking his mail. Hey there, Gaston. You tried to run away from me. It was probably an accident though. So can I come inside or we're just gonna stand out in the hallway this whole time? Dude, this is a sweet apartment. I like what you got going on here. Fish tank, grand piano. Oh, look at this beautiful view. Well, that's, that's not such a beautiful view, but down here is cute. Okay, how about I make us some nice food in your beautiful kitchen? I will make us some pancakes, the food of love. I'll even share them with you. This is so cute and romantic. When man moving into here. What's wrong with him? I think there's something wrong with Gaston. He's very unusual, isn't he? What's he doing now? Oh, he's coming over. And now he's angry at me. I'm making you pancakes. Oh, you'll regret that when you don't get to eat the delicious pancakes. Now are you happy? Get you a guy that looks at you the way Gaston looks at Belle. And you can eat pancakes in synchronization. Oh, this is a dream couple. Look at them go. 
Now I'm just all kinds of confused because I thought Gaston was going to turn out to be awful, but he's actually so sweet. Why don't we light a romantic fire? Oh gosh, that was scary. And we can snuggle up beside it. Wait, what's going on? Did he just throw up a little bit at the thought of me? I'm really confused. What just happened? Oh, we're going. <gasps> We're going to the massage table. He has a massage room? Oh my gosh. I just want to move in with Gaston. Maybe he's, maybe he's a professional masseuse or something. Oh, that Disney movie got Gaston all wrong. No, she did not just fart. Belle, you ruined everything. I can't believe you just did that. He massaged a fart out of me. Gaston makes a lot of weird noises. Ooh. All the time. Is this nearly over? I feel kind of uncomfortable. How was it? Great. Okay, what else can we do around here in your penthouse suite, Gaston? Um, I just realized that you don't have a bed. So that's pretty weird. Is he a vampire or something? How are we meant to woohoo when you don't have a bed? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna ask him to be my boyfriend. He is the best of all the guys that we have met so far. I have a question. <laughs> wow, that's fast! Oh my gosh, his name is Gaton. I spelled his name wrong. <laughs> that's why he's so nice! Because he's not Gaston, he's Gaton! Oh my goodness. I can't believe it took me so long to notice. This has been a terrible mistake, I'm sorry. We can only be friends. Also, I will need to use your bathroom before I leave. Sorry. <laughs> Awkward. I may have left you single, but at least I left you some pancakes. Goodbye. Well, I think it's about time that we went home. Hang on. Who's that? They have antlers. Oh my gosh, I thought it was Bambi, but it's just... A terrifying psychopath. Hello? Do you need some help getting back to the old people's home? Okay, that was a very weird day. Let's head to sleep. Why does she sleep on a bench? Why would you sleep on the bench when there is a bed up there? But at least we are progressing through the five guys quite quickly now. We had Travis Scott as number one, the mailman as number two. We almost had Edward Fine as number three, but it never went past flirting. So Gaston was number three. If we wait until Tuesday, GeekCon will be back and we can ride that love rocket finally with Edward Fine and tick him off the list and we'll be almost there. So I'm just gonna have her live out her life in solitude, reading books until Tuesday so we can see Edward again. One eternity later. Okay, it is time now to wake up because we are going to geek con young lady okay let's head into the city with edward and hopefully we'll be able to get our geek on and afrikan oh no i don't see any geeks what's going on edward i'm sorry i've brought you here under false pretenses I, I thought there would be a convention maybe it will appear if we go over here. This bench is actually an interdimensional portal and when we kissed on it last time we accidentally ended up in the wrong dimension so we just need to kiss again and we'll be in the right one where GeekCon still exists. Okay the kiss is complete. Is GeekCon there? There it is! The love rocket! The love rocket is in the station! Wow super awkward mailman's trying to meet me here. Hope he doesn't try and get in the rocket with us. That would be really weird. Okay let's head over here. <gasps> oh my gosh, look who it is. Why is he always here? He's just always around. Okay, Edward, you have been chosen for this mission. Let's woohoo in the rocket. What do we do first? Cool, we have space suits. Oh, how cute. And off we go. What now? Oh my gosh, look at her in her little spacesuit. Oh, the rockets come back. We joined the 50 mile high club. Good one guys, I don't think anyone noticed. Now uh, let's go back to that park bench. Edward, I have something to tell you. But first we'll make out. Over here. Where is she going? What? What's going on? Oh, she wants to make out on the sofa, okay. Oh, look at Gaston. Okay, this is weird. There's just an old lady walking past. 
There are so many people here, stop making out. In fact, Edward, I just want to be friends. Oh, somebody's taking off in the love rocket. There's a lot more woohooing going on at GeekCon than I imagined there would be. Okay, he seems pretty okay with the fact that I just dumped him. So I'm gonna get out of here and hang out over here because I really wanna see who went up in the love rocket. I just have to know. Oh, it's coming back into land and who will hop out? Who is it? Who is it? Oh. <laughs> it was some guy on his own. <laughs> Okay, well, that is it for this episode of The Sims 4 Disney Princess Challenge. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like, and I will see you next time.